Are you going to say you want to do something? Do it for two weeks and then quit? Like you did last year, like you did the year before last? You say you want to lose weight, get in shape, get your business off the ground, and then turn around and party, drink alcohol, eat like crap, and continue to live below who you were created to be. How long is it going to take to make the decision, to make the shift, and show some courage? It is time to go from mediocre to meteoric. It is time to go from being counted out to being counted on. I've never met anybody who became incredibly successful in any area of their life until they had suffered and sweated and sacrificed and kept their focus and fought through tears and trials and tests. And if you have a dream and you fully commit to it sooner or later, if you do not surrender, if you do not quit, it will happen. When I wake up in the morning, I don't think, am I motivated to go do what I'm supposed to do? No, I don't think about it for one millisecond. When the alarm clock goes off, I have no thought about whether this is easy, whether this is hard, whether I want to do it, whether I don't want to do it. None of that matters. It's an emotionless, thoughtless discipline. When the alarm clock goes off, you get up, you get out of bed, and you go do what you're supposed to do. I don't care how it feels. I don't care if it's easy or hard. It doesn't even matter to me. It's just a reaction. It's a discipline and it's life. And that's the way I choose to live my life. Too tired, too hungry, too sore, too hot, too cold, too whatever. People ask me what I do when I get those little feelings running around. Well, let me tell you what I don't do. I don't tell everybody. As a matter of fact, I don't even let those words run around inside my own brain housing group. I keep it secure, lock it down. To me, this is an everyday gig. Every day is a Monday, an opportunity to come out of the gate like a man possessed and attack the day without mercy. Today, I'm taking scalps. I'm putting the pressure on. I'm the aggressor. I'm on the attack. It's a lifestyle. Instead of hitting that snooze button in the morning and not making your bed, you don't hit the snooze button. You get up. You don't want to go run? You go run. You don't want to go swim? You go swim. You don't want to make your bed? You make your bed. You don't want to clean your house? You clean your house. You don't want to study? You go and study. It's going to suck. It's not going to be fun. Do something that sucks every single day of your life. That's how you grow. The only thing you do for success is sweat, is blood, is tears. You think you're going to get 50%? You think you're going to get 70%? You think you're going to get 80? There is no discount. You can't get 50% off. There are no shortcuts to success. Stop thinking they are. And stop wanting people to put you somewhere that you didn't earn. The real beast is when they legs give out. The real beast when they tired. The real beast find a way to pull something out when nobody else ain't got nothing. When you really want it, you no longer hit the snooze button. You no longer lose focus when you're studying. You no longer take shortcuts. You are willing to do whatever it takes. That means getting up early, going to bed late. That means you don't go to sleep when you're tired. You go when you're done. You might have put in some time, but you didn't put in the time. Yep, you did some workout. Yep, you studied a little bit. Yeah, you put in some time, but you ain't put in the time. The time that's required to make your dreams become a reality. You can't shortcut success. You got to grind and you got to put in the time. If you have the qualities of fortitude, grit, discipline, mental toughness, you wouldn't need a program for your finances. You wouldn't need another fitness program. You would understand how to execute. The missing link is and always has been you. In order to be the best, in order to get to the next level, you gotta sacrifice. You gotta be willing to do whatever you're asked to do. There are no shortcuts to success. There are no discounts to success. It's always sweat. It's always blood. It's always tears. You always have to give all to be the best. I'm not gonna sit around and wait for good things to happen to me. 
I'm gonna grind. I'm gonna fight. I'm gonna do everything in my power to become the very best version of me. When you do the things most people aren't willing to do, you will live the life most people never will. If you're willing to take the harder way, the more complicated one, the one with more failures at first than successes, the one that has ultimately proven to have more meaning, more victory, more glory, then you will not regret it. If you stay in bed, if you stay on the couch, if you stay in your comfort zone, if you only do what is easy, your life will be hard. But if you do what is hard, if you get up, if you grind, if you are relentless, if you work as hard as possible, when other people are slacking off, your life will be easy. One plus one is always gonna equal two. Two plus two is gonna equal four. In 10 years of work, when everybody else is partying, making excuses, doing the cool thing on the weekend is gonna pay off.